So today, today we're gonna do another review of coleslaw. What's, where's a place you wouldn't even expect to uh, have coleslaw? And we found out KFC actually has their own coleslaw and a lot of people recommend it. So today, Bun Touchers, we're going to KFC. I get uh, two coleslaws. Okay, one large coleslaw. I heard you guys uh, have the best coleslaw in town. Yeah, can I also get a job application? Uh, hi Bun Touchers, today we're going to be reviewing KFC Coleslaw. Uh, we heard it's the best in town. Uh, I didn't know KFC made a coleslaw, but I'm excited they do. I've been a fan of theirs for a long time, so we're going to dig in and test their KFC brand coleslaw. More of a creamy coleslaw, much more mulched up and the color is consistently green throughout. Uh, for me, it's not so much the consistency, it's the smell. This is a very, very pungent slaw. Um, uh, it smells like paint. It smells like paint. Does it? Like latex paint you would paint uh, a bedroom in. Uh, hopefully it tastes a little better than it smells. I know taste and smell can often uh, smell the same. So yeah, so uh, the consistency kind of looks like a frozen Slurpee, like a frozen Mountain Dew Slurpee. Mm -hmm. I can see a lot of bubbles in there, which in the Thrifty Foods coleslaw, there wasn't very many bubbles, but th that was a classical slaw. This is more of a mush slaw, like what they sell at Chick-fil-A in the United States. Uh, shout out to the guy that made that review video. I personally think the difference between KFC's coleslaw and the Thrifty Foods coleslaw is the Thrifty Foods coleslaw is much more traditional, maybe southern states uh, coleslaw, which is where it originated in the 1920s. Hmm. And this is more of a you know, young, hip, fun coleslaw. It looks fun. I think I'm going to have a lot of fun eating this. Yeah, you know, if you're like really lucky and you live close to a Thrifties and close to a KFC, uh, just go ahead, buy both, like, like live it up, you know. Uh, you know, if you don't have to work the next day, then this is a great choice. The, I think this is a great alternative for young folks who want to stay up all night drinking Mountain Dew and play the calls of duty. Uh, why not play something more educational and eat some coleslaw? Get in shape while you're having fun. Yeah, put on some Arthur. After today, yeah, I, I would say it's definitely tied for the best in town, for sure. I don't think the critics online lied. They were very right about this coleslaw. Uh, if I was recommending any, I'd recommend KFC or Thrifty Foods coleslaw. Yeah. I can really feel it sitting on my stomach. Mm -hmm. uh, and I can feel that the fuel is going to last a long time. You'd probably get the same sensation if you ate some wood chips. I would completely agree, Sam. It feels like in my stomach, like maybe I ate a sponge or a box of clams. Uh, yeah, you know, it's actually really interesting. Uh, before you came over, I was actually eating clams. Oh, no, I didn't know you were a fan of clams. Here's a simple pentagram to remember coleslaw by. See, well, that stands for coleslaw, silly. Oh, it's for, oh, great, I'm eating coleslaw. L, that stands for light snack on the go. E, energy. Coleslaw is packed full of energy. S, that stands for simple dish. L, live, laugh, and coleslaw. A is for anagram. And w is for Washington has the best coleslaw. Uh, overall, price. Price is good. $5 for a large gets you a lot of coleslaw, Sam. Sight. Uh, it doesn't resemble food. It looks like frozen Mountain Dew. Uh, and smell. Uh, not overly pungent, but not too pleasing to the nose. Taste. Uh, it's a tribute to uh, New Age slaw. Uh, you did it again, KFC. You, you hit it out of the park. And uh, what do you think of the consistency? 
The consistency was strange. It sort of melts in your mouth, leaving rivers of coleslaw behind. Uh, what would you say your slaw factor was? Uh, I'd give it nine shredded root vegetables. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, for me, my slaw factor was probably uh, 4.5 uh, Colonel Saunders out of mm. it was a seven today. I'd say that was probably a fair, fair number of Saunders. Yeah, he's not rolling in his grave about this dish. His no. legacy could easily live on uh, through this slaw. Mm -hmm. Agreed. Mm -hmm. Slaw's up to you guys. Hey guys, Sammy here. I was just going over the receipt and I couldn't help but notice you get your choice of a free small popcorn chicken or strawberry cheesecake with the purchase of any fountain drink on your next visit to the store. So if you guys want us to do a sequel of this video where we review the small popcorn chicken or the strawberry cheesecake with the purchase of a fountain drink, we'll probably get Mountain Dew, uh, just share, like, and subscribe. And uh, we'll see what the reaction's like from our vans, and then we'll go and do that.